Hey guys, it's April here um, with my crazy lion mane natural hair. Some of you guys may know me from Instagram, but otherwise I don't think you know who I am. Um, I'm just a normal girl and I really like makeup. Um, so a lot of people on Instagram and Twitter asked me to do a tutorial on just like this everyday look that I do. Um, so yeah, if you're curious and you want to see how I achieve this look um please keep watching so yeah and if you like this video please leave a like and subscribe bye so i have the mask of magnanimity on right now and you're just gonna want to leave this on for about 20 minutes 15 depending on your skin type and i just love this mask so much so i will be back once i wash this off so instead of primer, I use this Coconut Moist Cream, and I'm using this Catrice Concealer Palette. I'm going in with the green color first, just for my blemishes and any red spots. And then I'm going to go in with the orange color for my dark circles around my eyes. Now I'm going in with Lancome's Taint Idol Ultra 24 Hour Makeup Foundation. I love this so much. I'm putting it around and then blending it in with a fake artiste brush. Then I'm going to blend it even more with a beauty blender, a mini one. And then I'm just putting concealer on any extra spots that weren't covered. Now I'm going in with this Innisfree No Sebum Mineral Powder and I'm just going to put it on my nose and under my eyes to set it for contouring for my nose and for under my eyes just to prevent any creasing from the concealer. And just brushing off the excess powder here. Now I'm going to be contouring my nose with this Kill Brow Cleo palette in the lightest shade. Um, I know it is for eyebrows, but I find that it's the perfect color for contouring because it's just an ash, um, cool toned brown rather than too warm and too reddish for contouring. So I'm just drawing two lines with a little another fake artiste brush and blending with a fluffy brush. Now I'm just using this powder from the face shop just to bake down the middle and sides of my nose contour. So now I'm just brushing my eyebrows up before applying this e.l.f. clear brow gel and I just wait for it to dry before I apply any more product. I wait for that to dry first before I apply anything else so I'm applying lip liner in the meantime. This is NYX lip liner in the color Sugar Glass and I slightly overline my top and bottom lips um, and then I fill them in with the lip liner. Now going in with Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow and Ash Brown, I'm filling in my brows and I know it's going to be hard to see because of the lighting, I'm so sorry about that, but I fill in the bottom line first and then the top and I make sure the front is kind of faded. Then I'm going in with that same Catrice Concealer Palette using a color close to my skin tone and I'm just cleaning up the edges with concealer and blending it out. Now I'm just quickly blending the edges with a beauty blender and applying more of that clear brow gel on top. So here I'm using that same Cleo palette um, as eyeshadow. I'm using the same color I used to contour my nose with a fluffy brush and then on the bottom of my eyes as well. Now I'm going to use the Sleek Solstice Highlighting Palette. I'm using the yellowy goldish color in the inner third corner of my eye. For eyeliner, I'm using a Skin Food Brown Pen um, Eyeliner. I did it off camera, but basically I just put it in the outer um, corners of my eye only. And now I'm curling my eyelashes before I go on to mascara, and I'm using the Maybelline Great Lash, the Legendary Mascara. So this step is actually optional, but I'm going to put fake lashes on, but you put it on under your actual lashes. So a lot of people are actually scared to do this. I was scared at first, but it's not actually as scary as it looks. So yeah. 
So using Duo Lash Glue and Ardell Demi Wispies that I cut in half, I am putting eyelashes underneath my actual eyelashes. Now I'm using this Too Cool For School contouring powder um, just to give some life to my face and some dimension. I go around my whole face, mostly focusing in on the temple area and just giving myself a little bit more cheekbone <laughs> by contouring. For blush, I'm using NARS's Orgasm Blush and just put it on the apples of your cheeks very naturally. Once again, going in with that Sleek Makeup Kit and I'm going in with that um, yellowy color and also the bronzy color. I put down the bronze first with this little fan brush and then I usually put the lighter yellow over it to make a more blinding effect. I put it over my brows and on my cupid's bow as well. And then I'm just brushing off the bake and I'm going to put highlighter on my nose as well. Now going in with this Mounting Lip Powder by Clay Cosmetics in the color Hot Taco. I'm applying that all over my lips, um, just on top of that lip liner that I already put down. So this is the final look. I've been doing this literally every day for months now and I just love the way it looks natural but also very like um, neat I guess but yeah so I realized I didn't film an outro for that video so I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching my makeup tutorial I hope you guys really enjoyed it I hope it was helpful in any way um, if you have any questions about the products that I use or what I did um, please just leave them down below and I will get back to you as soon as I can. Um, yeah, if you have any requests for future videos, also let me know. And I hope to see you guys really soon. Thank you! Lots of love. Bye!